Hi friends, in this video we are going to discuss about the increment and decrement operator in C. So first let us discuss about the increment operator plus plus and the operation performed is that the value will be incremented by 1. So let us see an example, we have a simple code here. First we are declaring an integer variable var and initializing it to 5. Now we are printing the value of var, so it will print 5. Now we have var++ plus plus, which will increment the value of var and it will become 6. And now we are printing the value of var again. This time it prints the incremented value 6. So that was increment operator and now let us discuss about the decrement operator. So it works just the opposite of increment. It will decrement the value by 1 and the decrement operator is minus minus. Now, let us see this example C code to understand the decrement operation. First, we are declaring an integer variable var and we are initializing it to 5. Now, we are printing the value of var, so it will print 5. Now, we have var minus minus, which will decrement the value of var and it will become 4. And now, we are printing the value of var again. This time, it prints the decremented value 4. Now, we can use these increment or decrement operators in two ways as var++ and var. First, let us see the post increment operation. Here, the value is returned first and then only incremented. See this expression to understand this. We have b equal to a++. Here, first the value of a will be returned and then only a is incremented. So, see an example. Let a equal to 10 initially and we have b equal to a++. So, the value of a, that is 10, will be returned and stored in b first and then a is incremented and it will become 11. Now, let us see the pre-increment operation. Here, the order of operation is just the opposite. First, value will be incremented and then only it is returned. So, see this expression here, b equal to plus plus a. So, first, this increment operation will take place and then only value is returned. So, see an example. Let a equal to 10 and we have b equal to plus plus a. So firstly, a will be incremented and it will become 11 and now it is assigned to b. So that is the difference between post increment and pre increment operators. And decrement operator can also be used in these two ways as a minus minus and minus minus a. Hi guys, now you can get a lot of features in the official log to base 2 website easy registration and login process and once you log in you can access a lot of amazing courses you can watch the visual tutorials you can see the examples solve puzzles and finally practice problems all in a single page visit www.log2base2.com where learning is fun and beautiful and don't forget to let us know your thoughts on this